Hello friends, today we are going to see what is a uh, SI unit of mobility of the electron, okay? Uh, so, drift velocity is directly proportional to the electron. When the electron is moving in a conductor, so velocity of the electron, it's a drift velocity of the electron, is directly proportional to how much electric field. Uh, that means how much uh, difference of electric field you applied, okay? That is, uh, drift velocity is directly proportional to the electric field. That means drift velocity is equal to constant times of electric field. So, when we are removing the directly proportional, you should include the constant, okay? Here, constant only is a mobility of the electron, okay? Only for mobility of the electron, proton, we are not going to tell its uh, uh, mobility, okay? So, mu is equal to Vd by E. Uh, it is a mobility of the electron. It's a, Vd is a drift velocity. Uh, e is a electric field, okay? Uh, so, drift velocity is a meter per second. Velocity is a meter per second. Electric field, okay? Electric field is equal to force per unit charge it's newton per coulomb so newton per coulombs we can write okay uh, so this formula we are going to get coulomb as a numerator then we'll get as a meter coulombs by newton seconds okay so again what is newton newton is a force force is equal to mass into acceleration so that means kg meter by second square so instead of writing newton you can write as a kg meter second minus 2 into second okay so now we are going to change it the formula it's a minus 2 uh, plus 1 we are going to simplify this meter coulombs we are going to get kg meter second uh, minus 2 plus 1 will get as a minus 1 meter meter getting cancelled so this 2 i am taken as a numerator so kg second kg inverse plus 1 it's going to change as a minus 1 when we are taken as a denominator to numerator minus 1 is going to change as a plus 1 and coulombs okay uh, if you want to write a SI unit, I mean, this is fine. If you want to make it as a dimensional formula, uh, so you should take it as a current is equal to charge by time. Charge is equal to current into time. So, 1 coulombs is a ampere into second. So, instead of writing coulombs, you have to write ampere into second. So, kg inverse second plus 1 uh, coulombs is a ampere into second. So, final answer kg uh, second square, it's a plus 1 plus 1 plus 2 and ampere so this only we are going to get as a SI, final SI unit of mobility of the electron in case if you want dimensional formula m power 1 l power 0 t power 2 a power 1 the reason mass we are taken as a capital m length we are taken as a capital l time we are taken as a capital t current we are taken as a ampere thank you